big 84-56 victory over Eastern Illinois, excuse me, 84-58 victory over Eastern Illinois tonight. Coach, we'll start with an opening statement. Well, I'm very, very proud of the guys. Uh, they deserve so much credit. Um, nothing about their experience um, over the last couple of years has been, nothing's been normal. Uh, the pandemic obviously changed everything. We had an unbelievable amount of injuries. And, and now we're in a, a phase where not only do we get shut down, but we're in our last week of playing three games in a week. And that's just not normal for college guys having to go to school and to travel. It's just, it's a lot. And um, on top of that, for us, you know, we've five of our last six games, I guess five of seven now, uh, we're against the top three teams in our league. And, um, you know, we, we didn't get any wins against those teams, but we learned a lot about ourselves. Um, obviously, the game against Belmont the other day where we played, you know, really well. Um, obviously, Belmont made some plays as well, but that shot, you know, it, it's, it's just tough to get over something like that. And for them to come back out in 40, less than 48 hours um, as a group and perform the way they did um, without being able to practice, um, to basically it's all mental, um, and they did do it as a group. It wasn't like one guy just stepped up and put the team on their back. Everybody had a hand in on it. So um, they deserve so much credit for their toughness, their resilience, their togetherness, uh, for their desire to be competitors. Um, and we're excited about what's, what lies ahead for us. Obviously, with EIU, we understand about, you know, not playing so well one night, having a chance to look at it for a couple of days, maybe even get a practice in, and then try it again. Uh, we actually played better against Murray the second time, better against Moorhead the second time, better against Belmont the second time. And we expect nothing uh, less from them up there. It'll be a totally different basketball game, a whole new different set of challenges. Anytime you go on the road, you've got to be 10 points better than your opponent. Um, but we're looking forward to the challenge and excited about our schedule uh, moving forward here the rest of the way. 31 field goals tonight, 14 from three-point range. The offense was feeling it tonight. Yeah, you know, I think um, – We've had moments. Uh, we're starting to be a little more consistent. Um, I think playing against some of the better teams, the better defensive teams uh, in the league has helped us figure out what works. Not necessarily what can I do well as an individual player, but just what works against good defenses. And you hear the guys coaching each other. You hear them talking about spacing and cutting, playing on, being on balance, uh, being ready to shoot to basketball. The biggest thing for our team and we got to continue to grow with is um, our leadership needs to continue to, you know, to be challenging, to be caring, um, and make sure that we all understand that how important the defensive end of the floor is. And all good defense ends in a rebound. So just getting them to miss is only one part of it. Um, as our leadership starts taking hold of that, um, these young men really understand the fast break. And Keyshawn, uh, has done an unbelievable job with that and uh, is playing really well. I mean, you look at some of his numbers from a decision-making, playmaking uh, point of view. Uh, it's, he's always been good, uh, but right now um, he's at the top of his game. What a fantastic night for the guards tonight. Uh, Keyshawn was on fire, great floor, uh, floor general. Junior Clay putting up huge play after huge play. It was just really a good effort from the guards. Yeah, you know, I think um, we're just so proud of those guys. They, uh, they've they been here. They understand the type of culture that we want. They understand um, how important leadership is. And we've, we've invested a lot in them um, in terms of, like, encouraging them, pushing them, uh, trying to teach and help them learn as fast as they can. It hasn't always been easy. There's been bumps in the road. Uh, so when these guys go out and are able to put on a show uh, like they have been at several different points in time this conference season, uh, you're really, really happy for them. And I just believe there's even more for uh, Keyshawn, his teammates, um, our team moving forward. Um, challenges will be great, um, but I, I think we're focused right now on just getting better. And it's not, it's not so much about who we're playing, um, but it's about – how well can we play a, the, bat, the game of basketball on both ends of the floor, uh, regardless of what happened the last play? And we, like we are just bragging on the guards, the big men did their job too, 37 rebounds, out-rebounding them by 14. Yeah, you know, I think, um, you know, 
Mamadou got us off to a pretty good start tonight. He had a couple of nice catch and shoots. The guys found him. Um, we like it when Mamadou catches and shoots. Uh, everybody needs to encourage him to catch and shoot. Um, but he's always a lot of time a recipient of how well the ball moves. I think Amadou Silly is playing some of his best basketball. Um, he is his energy, um, his competitive nature. Um, he's had to be too because he's been going against some of the best front court players uh, night in, night out. And uh, that's a real challenge. And but I thought tonight in pregame warm up, uh, as well as against Belmont the other night in our last game. Uh, this guy is energetic. He's encouraging. He's showing leadership, and he's bringing the energy. Keyshawn, you almost had the atypical double double with eleven points and eight assists. You were finding ways to find the open guy. What were you seeing out there tonight? Oh um, man, just reading the defense. Um, you know, just pushing the ball and finding open man. You know, that's um, something I'm really focusing on. You know, pushing the ball. Is, you know, I know we're really good at that. Um, you know, I've just been. You know, just learn. You know, game by game. You know, we've been, like he said, we've been, we've been on a, uh, you know, a really good stretch playing good teams. So you know, just learning from that. Um, you know, just reading defense and doing what I do out there. Talk a little bit about Kenny and Junior's effort tonight, especially from three point range. They both combined for eleven three pointers and really kind of helped put the distance in between. Yeah, uh, Kenny going five for seven, doing six for eight. Man, it's 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 special. It's fun to see, man. Uh, you know, I love to see that. Um, you know, and just finding them and seeing the ball go in, you know, it's, it's, uh, you know, they had special nights. So that was, that's good, man. So uh, we just got to keep on, keep getting better. Um, you know, just keep doing what works. 21 assists for the team tonight and just very unselfish basketball. Yeah, that's something that we've been, uh, we've been harping on, you know, moving the ball, sharing the ball, uh, moving bodies, um, you know, and it's, it's, it's creating advantages for us. So, um, you know, we still have a lot of growth, um, you know, so we should watch this game um, to get better from it and, you know, keep getting better on that side. But I feel like um, we really we really did a good job on the defensive end today. Um, you know, we, we played hard. Uh, we gave great effort and it got us in transition. So, um, you know, that was, you know, we're really good at that. So, I um, mean, you just got to keep on, you know, focusing on what works and, uh, you know, keeping it better game by game. I've caught last couple of tough games against really good opponents. How are you guys, uh, from the player perspective, how were you able to just push that, put that in the rear view mirror and just move on towards what's up, what's up ahead? Um, and, you know, of course, you know, um, you know, battling like that with, with a team like that and losing in that fashion is, you know, it's hard, but, but to see this team turn around and um, show up how we did today was special. Um, so, you know, I just, you know, I, just, I keep growing as a leader and, you know, make sure everybody's on, uh, you know, in the right mindset and just, you know, to see how we perform to, today, uh, man, it's, it's special. It's, it's, it's really fun to see, you know, we should keep on, keep on doing that, keep uh, learning, you know, it hasn't been easy. Um, but, you know, that's, that's what we're here for. Congratulations on the win and we'll see you guys on Thursday. Thank you.